Yay! In 2019, we visited Donkokrom and met Gideon. Gideon has established some beehives here, so we visited him and we got to know that uh, the farmers in the French community of the Dija National Park have had a lot of confrontations uh, trying to go into the park to harvest honey wild honey so these wild hunters sometimes were confronted they were arrested and sometimes jailed so we saw an opportunity that the abundance of bees and a uh, lot of forage in this uh, agricultural landscape and then also the park was a good resource for people to keep bees we had our first training in hive making, especially using locally available materials like borassus and uh, palm fronds. And two years later, the people have made a lot of hives with a lot of colonies and they are doing well for themselves. So far we have trained more than thousand uh, farmers to keep bees with the borassus and basket, uh, basket hives and we are still training people. We have over 1,500 beehives installed and uh, many of them are having a colony and they are doing well. Last year, we have a small honey, about one ton, and we hope to multiply that this year. The future looks so good. Uh, more communities are asking to join. Recently, the COVID-19 situation even brought in people from the cities who had lost their jobs and they came to the villages and saw what was happening and asked to join. So uh, currently we are collaborating with the Wildlife Division of the Forest Com Forestry Commission to extend our project to nine more communities in the eastern corridors of the National Park. And we hope um, in the next few days, we are going to uh, begin training workshop for them to start building their hives and attract uh, swarms into them to manage. No, <laughs> Thank you.